Hello everyone, I'm Jessica Blackbird. Welcome back to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe. Today we're talking about a little boy who walks over to his neighbor's house, damages their car, vandalizes their car, and beats on their door in an attempt to get their nine-year-old daughter out of the house. So stick around for the video. It started off as a knock at Carissa Nash's front door in Forney. I look at my doorbell camera on my phone first before going to the door, and I see it's a, a little kid. That little kid is her nine-year-old neighbor with the whip in hand. The Kaufman County Precinct 2 constable says the boy may have been trying to confront the Nash family's nine-year-old daughter. Then after the second whip. Little boy, you better get your ass from off my porch beating on my door like this. I will call the police. You need to leave. It happened on Thursday afternoon off of Crosscut Drive in Forney when dad, Desiera Nash, got home. I'm coming yeah. to have a conversation with you, sir. Your son? I'll show you the video. Can you come look at our car? Seconds later. Can you please yes, stop, sir? Authorities say neighbor Ryan Brunson had a gun in his right hand. Officers say the gun went off, firing in the direction of Brian's daughter standing directly behind him. Oh my God! Precinct two officers arrested Brunson and charged him with deadly conduct. We tried to get Brian Brunson's side of the story. I spoke to him on the phone briefly where he posted bond and tells me there is a lot more to the story and that he now has an attorney. Authorities tell us all of this may have stemmed from when the kids were walking home from school. This stems from a bullying issue uh, between the victim's daughter and the young boy with the will. There's been several interactions between two of them. Um, at different times and different locations. The Nash family says they feel hurt. We know the history of the whip. This is a racial issue. He comes to the door with this whip. We're kind of scared to send him outside to play. In Forney, I'm Malini Basu. So the boy's father was arrested um, for shooting and he's charged with a felony. Um, according to TMZ, um, he actually fired the gun that the Nashes claimed he had on him and he's facing a felony charge because of it. Um, Kaufman Constable Precinct 2 Chief Administrator Jason Johnson told TMZ that this all happened on Thursday and the kid's dad, Brian Thomas Brunson, was arrested. Um, they allege that Brunson kept arguing uh, with them on his driveway with a Ruger semi-automatic pistol in hand, which in itself isn't illegal. According to the police, the boy actually came out as well with his dad and challenged the Nashes to a fight. What allegedly happened next is scary. The sheriff's office says Brunson is alleged to have put the gun down at one point on his porch, but then went back to pick it up after the argument persisted. And he allegedly handled it in a reckless manner, causing it to go off. Cops say the bullet almost struck Brunson's own daughter, who was standing behind him, but luckily it missed. He was booked for deadly conduct, which became a felony because of the would-be harm. The boy, who is nine years old, was a year off from facing criminal mischief charges himself. We're told, TMZ says... But as it stands, he's not going to be rung up legally for this. So according to TMZ, a little white boy came storming over to the home of a black family in Texas with a whip in his hand and a beating in mind, it seems. And the whole thing was captured on video. So I'm glad that they call the police, um, but it was also super dangerous to walk over there and confront these people. Um, I would have just taken it with the law because it seems that they had gotten into some kind of argument um, from what I've read before this. So it was clear that, um, you know, they should not have gone over there. It could have gone so horribly wrong, worse than 
what we saw in the video. You know, someone could have been killed after that gun was introduced to the argument. So you guys, um, let me know what your thoughts are about this video and um, put them down in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Share it on your um, your YouTube, your uh, Facebook and Instagram and see what your friends think about what happened in this video and this confrontation, this dangerous situation. Thank you.